Hi guys, Battle Group Gamer here, coming at you with another broadside of naval action, and today we're playing Cold Waters. We are still continuing our North Atlantic 1968 campaign, where at the end of last episode, we were given the task of intercepting a surface task force uh, looking to cause a little bit of mayhem. And we're not far from their expected uh, route, which will take them past Narvik before venturing out into the Norwegian Sea. And, uh-oh. Well, it's going to be kind of loud. Mid-80s, I'm thinking. Um, this is probably a submarine. I don't think this will be any kind of surface task force. Moderate duct, moderate layer, 232 feet. And we are coming in hot. On sonar, lost con Rig ship for ultra quiet. Oh, 99 decibels. Yeah, there's no escape in this one. Make depth two five zero feet dive by. Let's get just a, uh, under the layer there. And see what we can hear. Come right to zero eight seven helm I. Go ahead and turn around as well. Um, what was that bearing to sixteen? Oh, okay. Come left to. Let's go two, this way. One five helm I. Let me hit above Con the layer. Helm. Make depth two zero zero feet dive by. So then it's moving east. Come left to one four nine helm I. And it's above the layer. Oh right, um, signature. I'm guessing a November? Yeah. Yeah, it's Con a November. Sonar. Sierra 1 is classified as submerged submarine. So we can just go ahead and... Yeah, we're heading right for it. It's probably a lot closer than 5,000 yards. Also heading right for us. Come right to two zero nine helm I. Look out! He's heading right for us. Oh. Con sonar Sierra one is cavitating. Was that just a? Uh... Oh, he's definitely speeding up. Can't hear me like that. And we are operating silently. Oh, you are close. Shoot two three. Aye, sir. If he pings again, he'll definitely pick us up. Yep. Stop doing that. I wonder if any of those are going to be circular running. Feet. 
passing 500 feet. I don't think our torpedo will pick us up. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing, two, five, five. And I don't think any of those torpedoes are running circular. Uh, wow, that was, that was close. I don't think it'll hit, though. Actually, it might. Okay, it will. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra, one. Last bearing, two, six, six. Contact faded. Con sonar regained contact on. Sierra, one. Bearing, two, two, seven. I think as long as we just keep running circles under him, we'll be golden. That was a hard hit. Still traveling at 23 knots, though. For now. Con, torpedo room. Con, sonar. Switching the passive search. Oh, two, two, nope. Three. Definitely, uh, definitely very quiet now. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing, zero, zero, nine. Now we're just gonna, we're just gonna muscle right on through that. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Yep. Oh, up to 19 knots already. And that should kill him. Noisemaker bearing three, five, six. Well, that noisemaker was just a little too late. And yeah, none of these torpedoes. <laughs> Well, there's still a submarine nearby. But where? Con sonar, switching to active search. No return pings yet. Oh, behind me, shit. Con sonar, switching the passives. Come left to one, eight, nine, helm up. Make turns for two, five knots, maneuvering eye. And we've got a little bit of running to do before we can, I don't know, hear what we're up against. Probably another November, knowing the, uh, the way that these encounters are set up. Is that heading my way? Yes. Passing 600 feet. Con, torpedo room, tube 3 ready. Passing 700 feet. That may end up picking me up anyways. Feet now that we've passed the torpedo. Is that another one? I think that's another one. Come 
left to one, four, three, helm, I. Con maneuvering, making turns for two, five knots. All right, let's run this way for just a little bit. Con, dive at five, zero, zero feet, dive by. Come right to one, six, one, helm, I. All right. Rig shift for ultra quiet. Ultra quiet, let's see if we can hear anything. Oh, these are the last two Sonar Mark 37s I have. Two, two, nine. Designated Sierra, two. Then what? Con Sonar, oh, okay. new contact bearing, one, four, five. Designated Sierra, three. Oh, look, another November. Con Sonar, Sierra, two, is classified as submerged submarine. Oh, look, another November. Con Sonar, Sierra, three, is classified as submerged submarine. And... I really don't have the weapons to take care of this. Hell, I don't even have enough weapons to take care of the surface task force, I think. Nothing but Mark 16s after this. I mean, I've got 10 of them, so I can launch spreads at, you know, whatever the mission target is, but... Come right to two one zero helm I. Ship. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Well, he can't hear me, so maybe I'll just actually sneak past them. As long as they don't ping, I think we're good. Although, this one's heading this way. What does this go up to? Con, helm, steady course. A lot. It goes up by a lot. Come right to two, six, seven, helm, I. Come right to two, three, three, helm I. Sierra three will probably end up picking me up. And I can't go any faster, because then I will definitely be audible. Come left to two, one, five, helm I. Although I think at the closing rates, we're okay. As long as no one pings. Con, helm, steady course. Hurry up and load that. Come left to one six zero helm I. Con sonar regained contact on Sierra three bearing zero five seven. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra two last bearing three four seven. Contact is in the baffles. Con helm steady course. Come left to one one nine helm I. Okay, they Con, continue helm, heading north. Steady course. As soon as they get fifteen thousand yards away, I can disengage. They are both heading towards the wreck of the November.
Con sonar lost contact. Sierra three. Last bearing three. Four. Four. Contact faded. Okay. Too far away to hear now. Come right to one six eight. Helm I. So I think I can get away Con now Helm. with heading directly away from them and turns four. moving one, up to ten zero knots. knots. Maneuvering I. And we got to keep two Mark 37s, which may end up useful, definitely. And we can leave. Yes, I know that's not the objective of my orders. So we're just waiting for whatever surface task force. I would love some flights over here to see what might be coming. They are looking for me so hard. Yeah, that's it. Broken, light breeze, no duct, no layer, no escape. But we're coming in slow, so that'll help. Broken and light breeze. Upper 70s? Low 80s? Bring ship for ultra quiet. Upper 70s. Con sonar new contact bearing this, uh, one one zero Riga? zero two. Con sonar new contact bearing it's a Riga. zero nine five designated Sierra three. Come right to one six eight Helm I next target. Sonar Sierra Two is classified as escort. And spared love. Con Sonar Sierra Three is classified as capital ship. Wait. There's something else that I can't hear yet. Because that ping is not coming from the Riga or the Kashin. And Sverdlov does not have any sort of uh, underwater listening capabilities. This Riga concerns me. can't hear me yet, so maybe I can uh, get lower, speed along. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Come right to one, nine, three, helm I. Make depth five, zero, zero feet, dive I. I'm hoping the Sphered Love is in the middle, and I will be able to sneak in. Everybody's pinging now. Con, helm, steady course. There's still a third escort that I can't hear. That Cashin's a lot closer than I thought. Maybe the Riga is farther than I think. Come left to one zero eight Helm I. Come left to one two eight Helm I. I might actually be able to 
sneak in here. Unless someone turns, I'm set up very well. In before submarine. Con sonar new contact bearing <clears throat> zero nine five designated Sierra four. Let's start with the submarines. No, it's not good. Con helm, steady course. Oh, uh, that's a Kotlin. Con sonar, Sierra four is classified as escort. But since I'm just I now hearing it, yeah, zero, this thing is zero, way eight, nine, too nine. far away, and this Riga needs to go up north, please. Come right to one five. Two. Helm I. Right. Fine. What's my range? I can... I can totally hit that. Oh Helm, yeah. Steady course. Shoot two one. I sir. Gone fire control. We've lost the wire. Hmm. Oh, that Cashin. Oh, because he slowed down. Okay. Hopefully he'll speed back up. What does this go up to? Okay, we're still okay. Well, it's a good thing that I uh, launched that broken wire torpedo along the same pathway. It might actually hit the spared love. Okay, these two are far behind. Come left to zero nine. Six. Helm I. I am practically holding my breath. And the Cashin is turning north. But speeding up. Con, torpedo room. Bring ship for ultra quiet. Con, helm, steady course. Yeah, this is about to get very dangerous. Con, dive at one five zero feet, dive by. Go ahead and activate that. Seven thousand yards. With three in the tubes, I can wait. Okay. Just 19 knots. Mm, 
Nope. Speeding up. Sverdlov has slowed down. Oh, I'm gonna hit him. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. And shit, I don't think that one will hit. Right in the stern? No. But he is slowed down. Come right to one, five, three, helm I. Not slowing down enough. Uh I can't really do anything just yet. Man, that didn't do shit. Is he heading? No, he's not heading right towards me. That would that was a stupid question. Let him finalize his course Come for fleeing. One, one, eight. Helm I. And I can fire a spread. Is he... is his rudder stuck? Shit, I don't think I can wait very long. Yeah, I can. And these are my last four torpedoes. I mean, 26 knots, I can kind of, sort of catch up? This Cashin doesn't know what the hell to do. I really hope one of those hit. It should be a kill on the Sverdlov. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing. One, two, three. Yeah, that torpedo never did anything. I really, really hope one of these hit, but it is a damn near impossible angle. Maybe this one? These aren't. Yeah, maybe that one. And I really hope so, because I will not be able to launch another uh, spread. Wait. Con, torpedo room, two, one, ready. Sure would have been nice if uh, that Soviet torpedo had hit this guy. Oh no. Oh no. No, I have flubbed my shot. This is going to scrape the fucking paint. And it's at the end of their run. Jesus Christ.
Back down to 500. Make depth five zero zero feet. Die by. I will have to chase, and I think eventually the Sverdlov will run into some hard maneuvering places, and I can finally get Con, torpedo room, tube torpedoes on target. Come right to one, five, six, helm, I. <sighs> I mean, it would have been nice. Maybe I should have fired my Mark 16s first. Because he was traveling nice straight line. Ish. Sort of a nice straight line. This Conlin may end up being an issue. Come left to zero, four, nine, helm, I. Uh, the Riga has picked me up. Come left to three, four, eight, helm, I. Con, dive at five, zero. Con, sonar, regained contact on, Sierra, two, bear. Con, helm, steady course. How about the Kotlin? I need to get out of audio range so that I can chase southerly. Come right to zero eight nine helm I <sighs> con helm steady course. I mean I'm in the Cotlin's baffles, so that's a plus. Come right to one one eight helm I con helm steady course. Now, where are you going? He's looking for me. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra 3, last bearing 1, 6, 2, contact faded. That's fine. I just need to get around these escorts. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra 1, last bearing 2. Five. Come left to 0, 9, 8, helm I. Keep sprinting and drifting, trying to hear me. Still too close for me to speed up, because I will be detected. But soon. Keeps following the same figure eight. But I think Con sonar lost contact. Sierra four. Last bearing two, four, nine. Contact is in the baffles. Yeah, I should be Come far right enough away. Two, one, seven, one. Make turns for one, zero knots. Maneuvering eye. Come left to one, six, two, helm eye. Uh, 
Okay, well, it seems that I have evaded the escorts. Uh, what I'm going to do is pause the recording, and I'll come back when we catch up to the spared love. Okay, we're back. We have uh, kind of reached the end of our... Uh, thing here. Unfortunately, there is no spared love, and I have no fucking clue where he went. Normally, these things just flee in a straight line. Maybe he's over here somewhere? I'm gonna... Oops, I clicked off. There we go. Maybe he's over here somewhere. I'll check over here. But... Come left to zero. Eight, I've got my nine, scope up. I. I've got my radar masked up. I'm detecting nothing over here. Down scope. Lower the radar mast. <sighs> so, pausing the recording again. We'll see if we can find him. I hope so. Okay, we're over here. We've got our radar masked up. <clears throat> Nothing to be spotted over here as well. So I've set my course to head this way. Maybe the spared love turned and went to rejoin the escorts. Hope not, because I... Uh, like, these are the... Oh, I've got... I've got two more. Well, okay then. But still, they're Mark 16s, and... Unless I am suicidally close, I don't really have a good chance to hit. So, pausing again. I'm gonna time travel over to here and we'll see what we can see in the sea. Quick update. Um, I have I have traveled from here all the way over to here. I'm basically chasing these two sonar pings. Uh, which would be the Cashin and the Riga. Uh, Kotlin is still pinging up to the north. Probably still trying to look for me over here. So, still, yep, there's there's his ping. Right over to here. Anyways, I'm still flank speeding along. I'm, I guess, kind of hoping that the Spared Love reconnected with the Cashin and the Riga and... And I can intercept them over here-ish somewhere, maybe, question mark? But I'm starting to really lose hope on catching up with this spared love. Back to... I'll, I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, I'm... <laughs> I've been traveling this way, seeing if I can see or hear anything. I've got my ESM masked up. I've got my radar masked up. Nothing at all is registering at all. And I... There, there's no way in hell I'm going to either catch up or sink anything else. The Riga and Cashin appear to have just kept going this way, um, probably at some sort of flank speed. And I'm just not going to be able to catch up. The spare love has just completely fucking disappeared. No way to know where that guy went. I mean, maybe I should have checked up this way because that's back home. But I, I don't know. I was expecting this guy to just keep to just keep sailing this way, but never saw or heard anything in this area at all. So, yeah, I'm just going to have to exit out of this and just take take whatever result I get. Mm. Oh. Well, okay then. Excellent job, Commander. Your neutralization of this high-priority target will severely reduce the enemy's ability to hinder transatlantic convoys. Sinclant sends regards to you and your crew. Await further orders. Which should be to head back to Holy Lock. 
Convoys arrive. Convoys from North America continue to ferry goods into Western Europe with minimal losses. This has been attributed to efficient cooperation among uh, NATO... Wow, that was horrible. This has been attributed to efficient cooperation among NATO naval forces. The convoy system worked in World War I and World War II, and it still works today, a spokesman for NATO naval operations said. Yeah, holy luck. So I guess a single Mark 16 into the, for lack of a, and we're back in Denmark. NATO forces have launched a series of successful counterattacks, establishing a foothold in Denmark. It's disheartening to see the destruction of city and land, says one of the locals of Copenhagen. Yet we are all incredibly happy to be free again. The first thing I'll do is... Uh, to contact my relatives and tell them that we are alive. And after I rearm and get my mission and everything, we will uh, go ahead and end the episode. Alright, so once I get some new torpedoes, um, we are heading back to the Denmark Strait. Okay. Um. Seven. And the rest are going to be Mark 37s. Sixteen of them. Okay, so we're you we're going to holy shit they're there already. Come on, it hasn't even been a day. All right, we'll see if we can catch up to these guys uh, in the next episode. Thank you very much for watching this one, by the way. Feel free to leave a comment. Feedback is always appreciated. Like the video if you enjoyed what you saw, and subscribe if you'd like to see some more. Once again, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next episode.